looking at the fact that there is an ex-convict involved with the girlfriend from Deer Lodge Prison, and Ed had a bullet hole in his shoulder. He had a bullet hole in his shoulder from a 22 that went missing, and the Zodiac killed his first victim with a 22. I feel like one of two things happened. Either A, I absolutely fell in the rabbit hole. I am gone. Like, I can't see daylight anymore. I'm that far in the rabbit hole. Or everyone else is going to see this too. The similarities of the two murders are strikingly. You know, being on the lover's lane, the boy was shot up the scene. The girl was taken from the scene. You know, he has that paragraph in his book where he talks about being at the Lover's Lane murder. I'd, I'd forgotten about that. Where, where did that murder occur? Where, well, it's interesting he because he says it's November of 1960, so he says it's this murder. Oh, this, this one, yeah, 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 yeah. But what he describes actually matches the Great Falls murder. Because Larry Payton wasn't shot, right? Right, no, yeah. Our boy was shot and our girl was taken from the scene. Mm -hmm. But in his book, he makes it sound like he's talking about this one because he puts it in that chapter. And so once again, what he's doing is deflecting suspicion and creating a, a somewhat of a story, but it's actually leading you back to my murder in 1956. Mm -hmm. wow. Ed Edwards confessed to two Lover's Lane's murders that were very much like the 1956 Great Falls Lover's Lane murder and were very much like the Zodiac killings. The Kalitsky-Bogle case happened in 1956, and to this day, it's still an open cold case with no suspects. So it's the two murders essentially murder, crossed. Murder mimicry. It's murder mimicry. That's what Ed seems to do with Lover's Lane's murder. He kills him by rope, by knife, by gun. You have the 1977 murder of Lavaco and Straub that was committed by gun. You have the 1980 murder of Hack and Drew in Wisconsin that was committed by rope and by knife. You have the 1996 murder of Danny Boy Edwards that was committed by gun. Just the three he was convicted of were by rope, by knife, and by gun.